Welcome to our video on why snails can be detrimental to your garden. While snails may seem harmless or even charming, they can wreak havoc on your beloved plants and flowers. In this video, we'll explore the reasons why snails are considered pests in the garden and the negative impact they can have on your gardening efforts. Snails can be bad for a garden because they are voracious eaters that can cause significant damage to plants. They typically feed on the leaves, stems, and flowers of plants, leaving behind large holes and unsightly damage. Snails are particularly fond of young, tender plants and can quickly decimate a newly planted garden. Additionally, snails can carry and spread diseases and parasites that can harm plants, making them more susceptible to other pests and diseases. Finally, snails can also be a nuisance to gardeners, leaving behind slimy trails that can make gardening unpleasant. Overall, while snails do have a role to play in the ecosystem, they can be harmful to a garden if their numbers are not kept in check. How can you fight with snails? Let's find out. Remove hiding places. Snails like to hide in damp, dark areas during the day. Clear out piles of leaves, weeds, and debris from your garden to make it less attractive to them. You can also trim back overgrown plants and bushes to eliminate hiding spots. Use physical barriers. Create a barrier around your plants using materials like copper tape, crushed eggshells, or sharp gravel. These materials will create a rough surface that snails do not like to crawl over, which can deter them from entering your garden. Use natural repellents. There are many natural substances that snails dislike, such as garlic, vinegar, and coffee grounds. Sprinkle these substances around the base of your plants to create a barrier that snails will avoid. You can also create a natural spray using these substances and water to spray directly on the snails. Set up traps. You can set up traps around your garden to catch snails. One method is to fill a shallow dish with beer and place it in your garden. The smell of the beer will attract the snails, and they will fall into the dish and drown. You can also use a board or piece of cardboard as a trap. Place it on the ground in your garden, and the snails will hide under it during the day. Check under the board each morning and remove any snails you find. Use commercial products. If natural methods do not work, there are commercial products available that can help get rid of snails. These include snail baits and pellets, which contain chemicals that are toxic to snails. Be sure to follow the instructions carefully when using these products and keep them out of reach of children and pets. Hand pick and remove. Take a proactive approach by physically removing snails from your garden. Conduct regular inspections especially during the evening or early morning when snails are most active. Wear gloves and pick them off plants or from the ground, then relocate them to a distant location away from your garden. Encourage natural predators. Introduce natural predators of snails into your garden ecosystem. Some common examples include ducks, frogs, toads, and certain bird species like thrushes and blackbirds. Creating a hospitable environment for these predators such as providing water sources and suitable shelter, can help reduce the snail population naturally. Optimize watering practices. Snails are attracted to damp environments, so modifying your watering practices can help discourage them. Water your plants in the morning, allowing the soil to dry out slightly during the day. Avoid overwatering or leaving the garden excessively moist, as this creates favorable conditions for snails to thrive. Remember, using a combination of these methods and maintaining consistency is key to effectively removing snails from your garden. Regular monitoring and implementing preventative measures can help keep the snail population under control and protect your plants from damage. To conclude, by taking these proactive steps to remove snails from your garden, you can protect your plants, prevent damage, and create a thriving garden ecosystem. Remember to stay vigilant. Regularly inspect your garden, and implement a combination of strategies that work best for you. With patience and persistence, you can successfully bid farewell to those unwanted garden pests and enjoy a beautiful, snail-free garden. Happy Gardening!